While editing, I realized how close we were to losing the hive. We found multiple queen cells. This one looks capped. So we ran down to give the ladies an upgrade. Meet our latest residents at Beacon Ranch, a fresh hive of honeybees. Our last hive did not make it through the winter, but we're hopeful that third time's a charm. Let's check in and see how they're doing. This is our first check-in since we moved them in. Very active bees from Mississippi. We're gonna see if we can find the queen and we're going to put in a, a small beetle trap. You don't want hive beetles. These cap cells hold baby bees, almost ready to emerge. Up here, that's stored nectar. It'll become honey. These darker caps mean the baby bees inside are just about ready to emerge. And yep, there are still more queen cells down here too. We're adding the hive beetle trap. These pests can damage the hive and the olive oil catches them without using chemicals. Here's a reminder of what started it. Larvae in what looks like a capped queen cell. That's when we knew this hive needed more space fast. This is a super. It's like a second floor for the bees so they don't get too crowded. Fresh frames mean more space for comb and honey. We'll check back in in about a week to see how they're settling in. Stay tuned for another chapter of Beacon's Honey Bee Chronicles.